Today I am in Aberdeen for meetings with the oil and gas industry. I've been hearing firsthand about the challenges many businesses are facing. I also know it's an anxious time not only for those who work in the sector but also for their families. That's why as part of the work coordinated by the Scottish Government's Energy Jobs Task Force I'm announcing a new £12 million transition training fund. This will help people maintain the skills that the industry needs and where necessary retrain to support our wider economy. We're also making a further £12.5 million available to help firms sustain growth and compete internationally by developing new innovative technologies. These announcements come just a matter of days after we announced £379 million of new investment here in the North East. And of course, that's on top of £1 billion that the Scottish Government is pumping in to deliver the Aberdeen Western Peripheral Route and improve journey times on the Aberdeen to Inverness rail link. Aberdeen and the North East are central to Scotland's future growth and prosperity. My government stands shoulder to shoulder with all those affected by the downturn in oil price. We'll do everything within our power to propel the local economy forward in these difficult times and to ensure that the North Sea has a strong and a bright future.